Forecast is going to be key when we get to April 8th. Yeah, exactly two months away from today. Erie News Now is continuing our coverage of the uh, total solar eclipse that is headed our way with the uh, director of the Penn West Edinburgh Planetarium, Dr. David Hurd. Good morning. Good morning. We're so glad to have you here as we count down just two months. I feel like we've been counting down for it does. almost a year. <laughs> two months seems exactly been long close time. at the pace yeah. of that. That's right around the corner. And isn't I know it? you've been preparing for this with your students, yeah. with the public. Mm -hmm. Why is this such a big opportunity for us to see this? You know, it's so exciting to get get the people excited and also to make sure that they understand why this is significant. So we've been doing a number of programs at the Penn West Planetarium to help our local residents understand what's going on. Why is this so significant? Well, you know, I'm a pretty old guy <laughs> and I've only been in the path of totality twice in my life. Okay. okay. So uh, residents of Erie County you know, it's coming right through this area, so they don't even have to leave the county to be in the path of totality. Yeah, now the other two times, did you have to make an effort? To oh, yeah, them? absolutely. In okay. 1999, I went to Romania wow. for two minutes and 33 seconds. Wow. wow. <laughs> was it worth it? It was worth I it. I knew you did. And, That's then, a and then in 2017, I went to Nebraska mm. to purposely put myself in the path of totality. So, where in, are you going this year? <laughs> right here. Yeah, right out the back. Staying in Edinburgh. Well, with that path of totality experience, we've heard lots of predictions about, mm -hmm. you know, just hordes of people coming into our, you know, our corner of Pennsylvania, right. that path of yeah. totality. So from your experience, how accurate, how realistic are those predictions of this you know, yep. massive invasion? <laughs> Very realistic. Okay. And, and so that's why, you know, uh, Penn State and Barron Planetarium and, and the Penn West Planetarium, we're all doing programs to get people ready for it. But, but we're also kind of trying to politely tell the Erie County residents, stay home mm. because we have huge events going on at Penn West, we have, they have huge events going on at Penn State, but that's really for the people coming in from outside to enjoy. So, so exciting. it's, it's, it's going to be great. You can sit in your own backyard and enjoy the eclipse. Real quickly, Dr. Hurd, yep. how important are these glasses? Oh. How do you make sure you got the right ones? Well, it, they're extremely important and the right ones are going to have an ISO uh, uh, stamp on the back right. and, and it'll be certified. Right. So make sure they're ISO stamped or you can contact you know, Penn West Planetarium and get your tartan. Do you like that? The Fighting Scots. Or there you go. I, I know Penn State Barron has some. Oh, Visit yeah. Erie have their eclipse shades. So it's very important. And the only time, the only time that you don't need those glasses is during what we call totality, which we all know starts about 3.15 yeah. p.m. Right. Well, let's plan to check in with you again yes. in one month from today. Oh, absolutely. We're looking forward to that because at that time, I'll tell you what you can see during totality. I like All it. Right. Right. Dr. Okay. David Hurd from Penn West Edinburgh. We're coming back with some of uh, Mike Phillips' carpool karaoke. Stay with us.